Hello, I am Aziz Gmachan. I am from Université Qadaïed, Marrakech, Morocco. I will talk about morphine of hypervolute closet cubes. His work is made by Ahnshaw and I. Let's start by this video. Let's start by this video. This video, his name is Hyper Rock Games. This game is developed on hyperbolic surface, namely the Poincaré disk. As we remark, when a fighter moves toward the moves toward uh, the boundary, we we throw is Ari, but he not get never, he not get never to this boundary. This space surface is represented by unit disk with border circle, which represent the infinity. We found in this game only uh, the translation and only movement, we don't found shape transformation or shape morphine. So, our work is to develop shape morphine of, cool, of uh, closet curves on this surface. Let's look at the definition of shape morphine. Shape morphine is a special effect in motion picture and animation that change one shape into another through a continuous transition. Morphine has wide practical use in areas such as computer graphics, animation, and modeling. The blending between two curves Closet cubes play an important role in the area of generation of animation. Morphine on surface, as example, the uh, Poincaré disk is another concept of morphine. Why? Because the source and target closed curve are, if the source and target close are given on the surface and the internal curves, uh, the intermediate curves must be must stay on surface and must be closed. In this talk, we deal with morphine of closed curve on point caridis model, and we will answer to this requirement. Our approach is as follows: When we have a closed curves on red, we can approximate this curve by or hyperbolic by or hyperbolic polygon. And the discrete geodesic curvature of polygon approximates the one of the, the, curve, the red curve by this limit. Capi equal limit of the discrete geodesic curvature of the polygon. Then we will manipulate discrete curvature instead of curve. Now let's recall the related work in the planning case and in spherical case. About planning case, the, uh, there is three principal uh, methods. The first is based on exterior angle. The second is based on curvature. And the third is based on curvature flow. About the spherical case, we found uh, our work by our work uh, uh, in spherical case. Let's recall the point carry disc. The point carry disc is the open disc where the boundary where the unit circle represents the boundary at infinity. And our disk is equipped by this Riemann metric. 
and the geodesic associates to this Riemann metric are the line segments passing through the origin and the arc set that uh, intersect the boundary orthogonally. The associate distance, hyperbolic distance to our Riemann, Riemann metric is definite as follows. We will mark, for example, that distance hyperbolic between minus 1 and 1 is infinity. And in hyperbolic trigonometry, we found the sum of the angle of hyperbolic triangle equal P minus its IL. Now we talk about Mobius transformation. Mobius transformation is the only transformation that we have on the Poincaré disk. And the action is definite as follows. Now we have a special transformation. We can see that the rotation around the origin by on theta, definite by this matrix, and the translation uh, of length d along the geodesic that maps minus 1 to 1, definite by this matrix. Let's recall what is a hyperbolic polygon. Hyperbolic polygon is a polygon of each such that it's each R piece of geodesic. The intrinsic parameter of P at each vertex are geodesic edge length, geodesic length between two successive edge, and the exterior angle, delta. And we have the discrete geodesic curvature for each vertex definite by this. Now we have a fundamental question. When a polygon, a polygon or hyperbolic polygon is closed, when, I, for example, for this hyperbolic polygon, what is the condition to have Z0 equal Z, Zn? This condition is easy to to show, to prove, for the plan case, if we have a planar polygon, it is closed if and only if the sum of edge vector equal to the, to the null vector, which is equivalent to these equa two equations hold. We found here the intrinsic polygon, the intrinsic parameter of polygon its edge length and the exterior angle. Now about the hyperbolic case. Let's start by the case of the triangle. Let's Z0, Z1, Z2 or triangle. It is closed if and only if this equation holds where L theta zero is the rotation with, uh, the rotation with, with exterior angle delta zero. And L D zero, for example, is the translation along the geodesic Z zero, Z one. Let's illustrate this condition by this video. We apply the six, the six operator to each point of the triangle. And we start by translation, follow by rotation, follow by translation, rotation, delta 1, translation by LD0, and rotation by the exterior angle L delta 0, and finally we obtain the, our initial triangle. With the same idea, we can generalize it this for uh, for every every hyperbolic polygon. 
if we have our hypobolic polygon, Z0 equal to Zn, if and only if this equation holds. We found rotation and only by rotation around, uh, rotation by the exterior angle and uh, translation by the uh, hyperbolic distance. And this condition is fundamental to close the intermediate morphine, the intermediate morphine between two closet curves. Now, let's explain our algorithm. We start by the first algorithm based on exterior. Let's P0 and P1 our polygon, initial polygon. Source and target. Let's T with time between 0 and 1. The first and we have our hyperbolic, hyperbolic uh, edge distance. We interpolate between them and we obtain dkt. And it's the same. We interpolate the exterior angle. And we consider the first point of the first edge geodesic, the source curve and the, and the first point of the, the edge, the first edge geodesic, we consider the geodesic that run in this point and this point, and we take at the same t the point z0, and we consider the point z0. We consider the tangent of the geodesic the, this tangent of the, this geodesic at point z0 and this geodesic and this vector tangent to this geodesic at point z0 1. and we consider the tangent of the first edge geodesic of our source curve and the first tangent uh, tangent of edge geodesic of the target and we have this angle alpha 0 and alpha 1, and we interpolate between these, this angle, we obtain alpha t. When we have alpha t, then we can construct this tangent, and we take, and we take the geodesic of origin z0 t, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, engendre it by t, t by this uh, vector. Then we construct the first edge of intermediate curve and by induction we, con we, we can construct the, the rest of the, the points. Let me illustrate the, our construction by this video. We construct our intermediate curve by construction of this point in the edge and by using exponential map and uh, it's and the uh, log guide map and we close our our intermediate curve by a problem of optimization. Now we can we can uh, talk about the the second algorithm based on curvature. It's the same of the algorithm two, but instead of interpolate the exterior angle, we interpolate the discrete geodesic curvature. And we recover the exterior angle from the uh, exterior by discrete geodesic curvature for each time t. And we can uh, and we can build our intermediate curve by the same uh, construction of algorithm one. Now we see the result of our two algorithms. If we don't impose the condition, the closer condition, we found 
intermediate, uh, intermediate curve open with the first point and the end point. They, 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 we haven't the closure, we haven't the closure of intermediate. But if we impose this condition, we found intermediate curve closed, aesthetic, and uh, we can say also our G1 continuity. That's the first example. The second example it's the same, there is no problem to the closure to the closure of intermediate curve. And our intermediate curve are aesthetic and of and G1 continuous. Now we are apply our as application of our method we can morph between or beautifully and but at infinity as we, we see eh, at infinity that he our but and we can apply our our method to morph between a network of curves here we have a, a morphine between wolf's face and a bat. We applied also our method to 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 tie in to to have an animated tailing by using the blending of two given motifs. As the first example, here the second example, and here third example of animation tailing. Now, I'll pass to the conclusion. Conclusion, we have presented two novel algorithms for blending between two curves in the point carré list using their intrinsic variable. Both methods generate closed intermediate smooth curve by using the closure condition and by solving an optimization problem. This method gives tools to approach the geometry processing problem in the hyperweak space and could give a contribution in this direction. And we have a limitation. Both algorithms take a long time to generate intermediate curve then we can we can't apply it for a real chain execution hence the our future work is to give a rapid blending method which reduces the runtime thank you